With this ring, I thee wed. Say that one more time. <laughs> with this ring, I thee wed. I thee wed. Okay. With this ring, I thee wed. It's just the phrasing. I don't know. <laughs> Human beings. <laughs> That's all I can say. Oh my god. You are the sunrise waking my day. You are the moonlight shining my way. This is where I call home. I met Natalie back in 2014 when she transferred to Messiah and joined our cross country team. While we had so much in common and quickly became friends, I did not think back then that just a few short years later, I would be standing by her side as her maid of honor on her wedding day. Natalie quickly fit in perfectly to our cross-country team and truthfully, all the friend groups she immersed herself in after arriving at Messiah. That's the thing about Nat. Once you meet her, you fall in love with her. So given your recent long-term commitment in life for each other, I thought I would kind of make this uh, a little interactive. We're going to play a little interactive game called Did Jake Say It or Do It? Has Jake ever ruined a dance floor vibe at a wedding by dislocating or injuring a joint? Yes, I have. <laughs> Perfection. Has Jake ever accidentally worn his sister jeans on a family vacation? They were Bermuda shorts. They were Bermuda's people, fit for the weather, absolute perfection, quality dresser, this man. You are the fire warm in my night. With you I'll stay till the morning light. This is where I call home. This is where I call home. You It's on. <laughs> Perhaps you know that Natalie likes to run. She promised Jake she wouldn't run today. <laughs> they have been training for this day for a long time. And not just for this day, but for a lifetime of love and commitment. Prayers have been lifted up for them. Examples have been given. Advice has been given. Now they are ready to embark on this journey with the one whom God has chosen the other to run alongside. I want you guys to remember that this is a long distance run. Natalie, first and foremost, I love you. You have helped me develop into the man of God I am today. You have pushed me to be a better person in all areas of my life, but most importantly, you have pushed me to become a strong spiritual leader. When you're in a room, you're always pushing others to be better and always putting others' needs in front of your own. Your intelligence and humor all light up a room when you enter. I promise to wake up every morning and continue to pursue you. I promise to get excited about the track and field MAC championships, or at least try to, as much as you do. I promise that I'll be there through thick and thin, and I want to be that person that supports you. I am beyond excited to spend the rest of my life with you, and I look forward to what every day has in store. I love you. In the sixth grade, through my wire-framed glasses, I could tell that you were going to be someone special. Little did I know that the cute boy who also liked warrior cat books would become my best friend, my biggest supporter, and today, my husband. I love your adventurous spirit and your love to be surrounded by God's creation. You find joy in every morning and are the patient, loving, and selfless man that I've spent years praying for. I promise to always pursue you. To challenge you and chase your passions with you. There will be thousands of walks and hopefully runs, snort laughs and snuggles. There will be cloudy days and together, hand in hand, we will walk through the rain together. We can run in the rain too if you want, I'm okay with that. I promise to be a devoted, godly wife who will always strive to support you and cherish you. 
As the head of our family, I promise to pursue you, invest in you, respect you, and always put you first. No matter what lies ahead for the two of us, we will face it together, no longer two, but one. With coffee in hand and trusting the Lord's unending faithfulness, I can't wait for this new adventure with you. There's so much joy knowing that all of my tomorrows include you. I love you to the moon and back, and I'm super stoked to be your wife in a few minutes. When I'm lost at sea and waters unknown, you are the current pulling me close. This is where I call home. think that you haven't learned everything there is until you have a daughter. For instance, does anyone here know what happens when you flush a toilet after it's been filled with an entire container of baby powder? I do. <laughs> I've also learned that I am as proud as you can imagine. That's how you've turned out. You live your life with a great integrity. You're mature, beyond your years, you're kind. I hope that your days together are filled with love, laughter, and happiness. I now pronounce you our husband and wife in the name of the Father and of the Son and the Holy Spirit. Amen. You may kiss the bride. that we present to you for the first time as husband and wife, Mr. and Mrs. Jacob Miarelli. Woo!